has you close to his heart and you will get through this and today be encouraged be lifted up by the holy ghost today dear ones because god has you in his hands god hears the cry of your heart some are walking in joy some are walking in peace but some are troubled today and they are tormented by the enemy and god wants you to know i'm with you through this i have a solution here that i love you no one loves you more than i love you dear ones and i am with you I have solutions. This will come to an end soon. This will come to a conclusion very soon. Walk with me. Stay in the word. Stay in prayer. No one loves you more. He's going to say that over and over again in the next remaining minutes. No one more loves you more than your Savior from the before you were saved. And I protected you from so many things that you are unaware of. And until you are with me, you will understand how I protected you before the day of your salvation, God says. But today I am with you just as I was when you were in the womb. I know you, I knew you in the womb and I know today what you're going through. And I love you so very much, says the Lord. You are so important to me and this will not take you down. These words today will lift you up because I hear you. I know your prayers. I send angels round about you. Be lifted up today. Be encouraged, my precious one. You are my watchman. You are aware of what's happening in these last days, and you are important to me. You are an important vessel to me. No one loves you more than your Savior. So hear me today. Take this in your spirit, dear one. This is your Holy Spirit. The work of the Holy Spirit working through a yielded vessel. Cling to this word today because this will come to an end and you will grow through this. You will know me more. You will be more yielded because I have done a mighty work in your life. I love you. I care for you. You will not be damaged. You will not be hurt. You will come through this stronger and knowing me better and better. Ooh, thank you, Lord. So the people that need this today, almighty God, the, the warfare was mighty here, Lord God. So I know this is an important word. If it doesn't come through YT again, I will push through because this is for the encouragement and the uplifting of the body. In Jesus' name, watch over these children today that are going through this situation, Lord God. I don't even know how to pray it uh, verbally, Lord, but the Holy Spirit knows. They know who this, their name is on this word of knowledge. So, Lord, they're already listening and receiving and encouraged, and the love of God is falling upon them. In Jesus' name, the blood of the Lamb will protect them as they walk through what they must in this situation, and they will know their Savior, and they will feel his love this very moment in time, wherever they are in the world. In Jesus' name, in Jesus' name, let this word penetrate the spirit of those in need today by your Holy Ghost. In Jesus' name, in Jesus' name, thank you, Lord Almighty God, for your anointing, your presence, your glory, your Holy Spirit. We praise the Savior and Father God, we worship you. Hallelujah, hallelujah. In Jesus' name, hallelujah, Jesus' name, Jesus' name. Take this word, church, take it, take it. Write me comments. It encourages me when I know I'm moving in obedience. I know that I know this is for some. So please send me your name. We'll put you in the prayer journal. We'll continue to pray for you. You're going to get through this. You're going to be stronger. You're going to grow in this. God is growing his church up quickly through all of our circumstances, through everything that comes our way in our prayer life, uh, attacks from the enemy. We're only going to go stronger because the Lord knows our days are numbered on this earth until we are raptured up to be with him. Be encouraged. He loves you. He hears your prayers. He's with you today. He's protecting you. You're in his hands and you're in his heart. In Jesus' name, God bless you. Take this word of knowledge in those that need 
this today. Those of us that are praying for those in need, we're blessed. We're blessed that we can pray for the body that's in need today. God bless you. God be with you. Watch over your family, your children, your grandchildren. In Jesus' name, amen.